The terrifying reason Camilla nearly missed her wedding with Prince Charles. In her best-selling book, The Duchess, The Untold Story, Penny Jr. revealed how Camilla came close to missing her wedding with Prince Charles. The terrifying moment came as the Duchess of Cornwall was hit with a bout of illness on the day of her wedding. Ems Jr. wrote, Camilla was not well on the day of the wedding. All that week she had been at Ray Mill House suffering from the sinusitis. Several friends had come to see her and they had had girly evenings in their dressing gowns, while Lucia Sandra Cruz, who had introduced her to Charles all those years ago, came to administer homemade soup. In Chile, everything is cured by chicken soup, she'd told her friend, and had made her eat it. She was terrified Camilla wasn't going to get to the wedding, she was really ill stressed. On the day itself it took four people to coax Camilla out of bed. She'd spent Friday night at Clarence's house with Annabelle and Laura. She still wasn't feeling well, but now it was more nerves than sinusitis that kept her under the duvet. She was terrified. Camilla later made it to the wedding, though her initial illness was only one in a series of mishaps that unfolded in the years leading up to her marriage to Charles. Among the issues was getting Queen Elizabeth II on side, who had allegedly disapproved of Charles and Camilla's relationship. In early 2000, the monarch was reportedly so upset with her son that she refused an invitation to his 50th birthday party. The snub was largely regarded as in relation to Princess Diana's recent passing, and Charles' decision to quickly move on with Camilla. Then, later in 2000, the Queen accepted an invitation to an event in Highgrove knowing Camilla would be there. This move was largely regarded as a sign from the Queen that she accepted and approved Charles' relationship. Although the Queen had given her assent, the public had far from approved of Camilla. A 2004 poll carried out by Vanity Fair revealed that just 32% of those asked were happy with Charles and Camilla getting married. Other participants, including 29%, were against the marriage altogether with a further 2% not caring to give an opinion. Some Brits began to accept Camilla as a feature of the royal family, but this was all ruined when the pair announced their engagement in February 2005. The public, on the announcement, burst into anger. Ems Jr. in her separate royal book, The Firm, The Troubled Life of the House of Windsor recalled how some exasperated members of the public had reached out to her. The royal author said she received countless emails from viewers of BBC Breakfast expressing their utter disgust at the news of the engagement. One woman went as far as to station herself outside Clarence's house and announced that Charles should never be king if he wedded Camilla. Though public opinion mounted against them, Charles and Camilla married in April 2005 at Windsor Guildhall, followed by a grand ceremony at St. George's Chapel.